Hi friends, happy Thursday, happy last day of summer school. Um, I'm sure you guys are excited about the last day of summer school, maybe others not so much. Um, but for our last lesson of the of summer school, we are gonna be talking about patterns. Um, and it's important to talk about patterns because you guys are going to be um, learning more about patterns um, in kindergarten. And if you're staying in pre-K another year, we will continue to learn about patterns, okay? All right. So what's a pattern? A group of objects or pictures that are arranged in a specific way. That's what a pattern is. And often patterns are repeating themselves. So what repeating means is they start again and again, okay? So there are three different types of patterns. Um, not just, not only three, but we are going to be talking about three different ones, three um, most popular ones, okay? So the first pattern we are gonna be talking about is called an ABAB pattern. So it has two um, different objects in the pattern. And often these patterns are, um, they are made of different attributes. Um, or they have different attributes, excuse me. So there could be a shape pattern, there could be a color pattern, a movement pattern, and there's many more, but we're just gonna be focusing on um, three different attributes of um, patterns, okay? So let's start with our shape pattern. Square, circle, square, circle, square, circle, square, circle, square. What would come next? Circle, that's right. Good job. All right, next is our color AB, AB pattern. Green, blue, green, blue, green, blue, green, blue, green, blue, green, blue. That's right, that's um, the color that would come next. Good job predicting. Um, and our last pattern, AB, AB pattern is a movement pattern. So we're gonna say stomp, clap, stomp, clap, stomp, clap. All right, let's do it by ourselves. So we're going to stomp, clap, stomp, clap, stomp, clap. Good job, guys. All right. And our next pattern is called an AAB pattern. So again, this pattern has, um, has two objects in the pattern, um, but they're in a different order. Okay. So let's talk about it. Circle, circle, triangle, Circle, circle, triangle, circle, circle, triangle. That's right. Our color pattern, let's do it. Purple, purple, pink, purple, purple, pink, purple, purple, pink, purple, purple, pink. And our movement pattern, it's gonna be a little bit different. The same moves, a stomp and a clap, but different order, okay? Stomp, stomp, clap, stomp, stomp, clap. Let's do it, ready? Stomp, stomp, clap, stomp, stomp, clap, stomp, stomp, clap. Good job. All right, so that's our AAB pattern. Our last one is an ABC pattern, okay? And again, our ABC pattern has three different objects in our pattern, okay? So let's start with our shapes. Circle, square, triangle, Circle, square, triangle, circle, square, triangle. Good job, guys. All right, let's do our colors. Red, yellow, blue, red, yellow, blue, red, yellow, blue. All right, and last is our movement ABC pattern. Now we're gonna have one, one more move in there. Three different moves. Stomp, clap, snap, stomp, clap, snap. Let's do it together, okay? Stomp, clap, snap, stomp, clap, snap. One more, stomp, clap, snap. Good job. See, it's repeating. We start again and again and again, okay? All right, so friends, these are our three different patterns. Again, an ABAB pattern, an AAB pattern, and an ABC pattern. Um, so I am going to show you guys um, how to make a pattern out of um, objects that I found in my house, okay? 
So we're go I'm going to make an A, B, A, B pattern out of my markers that I have, okay? So let me see if I can situate my camera. All right, can you see them? All right, so Miss Megan, I'm gonna start with blue. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow, blue, yellow. What would come next? So we have blue, yellow, blue, yellow, blue, yellow, blue. That's right. Good job, guys. All right. So I just made an ABAB -A -B pattern out of um, some items that I have in my house. And now you guys are going to create patterns out of maybe toys that you have um, around your house, um, candy or different objects that you have around your house. Um, so I can't wait to see the pictures that you guys have. Um, let me know if you have any questions.